That was absolutely beautiful. All that, all that death right there, you know, from that one explosion. That was, that was a thing of beauty. Uh, why is this body sticking around? It's making me feel a bit uncomfortable. Fuck it. Let's go up. I don't know how I ended up at the bottom, like I said. It makes no sense to me whatsoever, but I'm assuming, like, I just kind of, um, jumps at the wrong time, and... Um, but the animation should have showed it. It didn't, though, did it? Is that something on the other side? Oh, it's just a lever. Sorry, I thought there was, like... Some enemy or something like that. Right, here we go. Jump. There we go. Okay, so what we got? We got a couple of vases. Give me your contents. Ah, great. More sniper bullets. We definitely need those. Wait, the merchant's here now. Why not, I guess? Whoops. Um, I should reload. Yeah. Two extra bullets. It's all good. Thank you. Right. Can we get through here? Uh, there's another place we can jump across, but is there any point? Hey, buddy. Do you wanna, like, let me in? I uh, guess not. It's for his own safety, I suppose. Right. And... Boop. There we go. I'm guessing that just opens this. Seems to, yeah. And it opens the other side as well, possibly. Now this... Looks a little bit dangerous. I mean, it's just giving us this. And I don't feel comfortable with that for some reason. No, it's alright. What is it? Oh, it's another elegant mask. That's a surprise. I thought it wouldn't give us the same thing twice, but I'm not really complaining because, you know, that's more money for- <sighs> Eleven! Nice! That, uh, you know, it's more money for us, so we can combine that into there. And this is an actual, um... What? A pendant designed with Los Amu Illuminados motif. Huh. Okay. Um, might pay to keep some of these then. Like, um, I can probably sell, like, some of these, at least because I've got four of them, but if I keep that one, and maybe keep one of these, then, you know, I might make a second of these, you never know. So, um, guess I need to head over the other side now. I can't actually jump from here, though. Oh, I can jump down, that's no use. I need to jump across, if that's okay. So let's get on this side. Do, 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 do. There we go. <coughs> Right, and our merchant friend has been freed. Oh, what the hell? What's this all about? There's a little balcony next to him. Oh. Of course, that's where the stairs led up to. Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. You better have more than just some rare things, because I have a lot of things to sell you, so, you know. I have plenty of, um, should have plenty of cash to buy things. Oh god, that's nice. 22,000. And I can sell the blue velvet, can't I? The velvet blue. I can sell some of the green eyes, as I mentioned. You know what, I'll keep two of them, for now. And then, yep, I can sell that. That's a lot. Buy it at a high price. Yes, you most certainly will. Like bloody hell, thirty-two thousand. That's the most we've come across yet. Now I don't know about the pendant. I get the feeling I'm supposed to keep that for some reason, but you know, right? Um, unfortunately, all the upgrades have been on handguns. Yeah, it doesn't look like anything else has any upgrades. Oh well, never mind. Well, you know, we've got to stockpile a cash uh, that we're building again so that we can upgrade things and possibly buy the mine thrower. Hmm. Not a bad idea. Really not a bad idea. Attaches to objects and detonates after a period of time. Got the rocket launcher as well. It's single fire. <sighs> I don't like using rocket launchers in the modern Resident Evil games. It makes them s it makes the game so easy in terms of five, so yeah. Anyway, um didn't really buy anything, did I? Let's sa uh, let's sell the game. What? Let's save the game. We're not going to sell this game. I'm not done with it yet, so, you know. Plus, it's on Steam, you know. Can't really sell it, can I? Disadvantages of PC games. Unless I stole, sold my old Steam account. Um, right, so we can't go through there now. I'm guessing he closed that off because Ashley is exposed or something like that, you know, to force us to go around this way instead. So we've got to go to the left now. Um, wow. There's a lot of things to do here, but we're making good progress, at least. I mean, 
we've cleared up quite a lot so far. Huh, what do you reckon to backtracking, guys? No, we're still on the same chapter, aren't we? But, hang on a moment, what's this lead to? Suspicious. A little bit suspicious. I think I might go back. Just to see if we can actually use that. I don't know if we can, though. Hmm. We can most certainly go back. God, this place looks gorgeous, doesn't it? So fucking nice, especially from this angle. Very quiet. I get the feeling that this is going to tie back to this room anyway. No, it's locked. It's all locked, yeah. Don't know why I'm even trying. No, the, the other door's in the way. Yeah, no, never mind. Fuck it. Let's go back. Plus, we're on the same chapter, aren't we? We haven't moved into another chapter yet, so not much point in backtracking. Uh, but like I said, if, providing I haven't got Ashley with me, it's probably a great idea to do plenty of backtracking and stuff like that. Oh wait, that's open now? What? What was the point in closing it? Hmm, never mind. Let's head upstairs and go through the other door. I'm gonna change guns because, you know... Not the best gun to have a close range, is it? We gotta remember that we've actually got some magnum bullets now as well, because, um... No, we've been absent of them. That was a lovely door, by the way. Ah, the game crashed again. <laughs> what is it with rooms with merchants? Like, and this game crashing all the time. I think I'm just gonna refer to all these crashes as the merchant's curse or something like that, you know. I think it's kind of fitting. Oh. Lovely bit of daunting music here. And this almost sounds a bit Cove Veronica-ish, actually, with the... Yeah. I see a red herb right there. I can't tell if I hear movement because of the music. It sounds like mu movement in itself, if you get what I mean. No, I hear something. Definitely hear something. Someone whispering, maybe? Could be a few of the what's it enemies as put well. Yeah, a few of the like monk like enemies. <sighs> Glad to have those with us as opposed to um what we've just encountered. If that is the case, obviously. Hmm. Nothing in this room. What's this? Um Castellin. Castellin memo? I think? Yeah. For many years, the Salazar family has served as the... Oh, ca Castellan. That's a, uh, yeah, of this castle. That's like the owner, isn't it? However, not everything is bright, for my ancestry has a dark past. Long ago, there was a religious group that had deep roots in this region called the Los Illuminados. Right, okay, so they're not actually... It's not a it's not a breed of infection, I see. I thought it was or a virus or whatever. I thought it was um a virus, not the name of like a group or something down the lines of that. Unjustly, however, the first castellan of the castle took away their rights and powers. As a follower of this religion, and as the eighth castellan, I felt that it was my duty as well as my responsibility to atone for that sin. I knew the best way to atone for my sin was to give power back to those we once took it from, the Los Illuminados. As expected, it took a little time, but we were able to rejuve uh, re rejuvenate the once sealed Las Plagas. With this success, I was one step closer to the revival of Los Illuminados. The reason why I released the Las Plagas from deep under the castle sorry, this castle, and give them to Lord Sadler was not only to repay for the sins of my ancestors, but I felt certain that the Lord would make better use of this power to help save the world. Right, okay, so Sadler is part of this cult, and Salazar basically bought the cult back, I understand, to save those that have sinned with the power of of the Las Plagas, and cleanse their souls by, uh, sorry, creating a world without sinners. The way it was meant to be, once cleansed, they would become one of many Ganados, where they will find their reason to live. 
and after the Lord su succeeded in creating the world in which he has envisioned, then the sins of the Salazar family will be atoned for. So he feels some sort of guilt for what has happened due to his ancestors, I see. There's definitely some enemies on the other side of here. I am digging the soundtrack so hard. It is good. Like, so far actually, a lot of the soundtracks in this have been great. Pretty much the same as Resident Evil 5 soundtracks, you know, like very kind of atmospheric ones. As opposed to um, flat out soundtracks. So, what are all these pictures around? I should have a look, really. They must have something to do with Salazar's family. You know, like the other Castellans or something? Possibly. I don't know. Anyway, let's um, be very careful and move through this door here. I'm gonna guess there's enemies on the other side of it. Oh, uh, yep. Might be best I get back a little bit because, um, yep, for as much. That's a lot of fire on me. And... I just saw the arrows kind of fall through the floor afterwards. If I just kind of keep opening the door here and now. Oh god. No, I need to get in there. I've got to snipe them. I'm going to have to try and snipe them while they're shooting at me. Hopefully they won't hit. If I can give one of them vision of me and not the other- Oh, for fuck's sake, the door though. What a pain in the ass. No, don't do that. It did kind of work, actually. Right, now. Bastard. Right, get one of them quick. There. Now get the other. I forgot that you could shoot them out the air. Completely forgot about that. I see one down there. I'm not going to take any risks. I'm going to take him down. Though I need to be careful because, yeah, we don't have much ammo left in this, do we? Keep forgetting about that. Are we safe? Oh, thank you, a herb. That's great. I see some explosives over here. That could definitely come in use. And we can jump through there? Hmm. Well, let's, um... Very cautiously move forward. I could definitely toss a grenade up there. I don't think Leon's arm's strong enough for that, though, unfortunately. Uh... Because they are kind of grouped together, aren't they? Let's take this. And... Anything else for me? Great. More rifle ammo. Might be a good time to, um... Do a little reload, actually. Never mind. Do you want to come over here? Come on. Don't be shy. You have all the time you need. Right, okay. Now he's breaking into a run. Why not, I guess? Right, let's get him. You know what I'm thinking while I'm doing this? Where's Ashley? <sighs> Can't take my mind off her for, like, one second. I'm still panicking about her and she's not even bloody here. Um... Can't see the point in that window. Cannot see the point in that window. Maybe it's to die through after we've been through here because maybe a load of enemies come back through here. And we can lure them around or something like that, I don't know, but... Only one way to find out, I suppose. There was another door on the left, apparently. Oh no, that might be upstairs. Yeah, I think it is. Let's just go through here, shall we? Right. Hello? Actually, seems like there's no one here. There's a guy up the stairs, but yeah, don't see anything else. Lovely portraits around here. Do you want to come down, maybe? Might be a good idea I lure him down on his own just in case there is more than one enemy. You never know. Come on. Doesn't give a shit. Holy fuck. Right, fine. Uh, it's one of the guys with masks on, so getting headshots is kind of out of the option, I guess. Don't feel so bad about wasting my ammo on him now. Hmm. Seems to be safe, for the most part. We are upstairs now, we've got to be careful. Hmm. Well, I've obviously got to jump across there, haven't I? But these guys are just kind of stood there at the moment. Might be a good idea to take down one of two of them, you know. Just before we go down there. How do we get down there? That's a good question. I could possibly have shot this down, I don't know. That said, I've not really seen anything too environmental like that yet. Uh, we can get down here. 
they really can't do shit about us being up here, so I think I'm gonna throw a grenade down. I'll throw a fire grenade, just so I'm not wait- oh, wait a moment, hang on a moment, never mind. I see some explosives on the left here. I got one on. And then there might be some on the right, you never know. Uh, if we can get around the other side. B -b 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 um, no, there isn't. Never mind. No problem, though. I think what I will do is pick one of them off with, a sn with our sniper. Just so we're less in trouble. Why where did he run off to? He went somewhere, that's for sure. There we go. Problem solved. Right. Hmm. That's a little bit suspicious. A little bit suspicious. Is there anything in this room before we jump down here? No, there isn't. Just checking for treasure, obviously. I think he ran off to the next area, by the looks of it. Might be a good idea to get my, um... Wait, no, never mind. Oh, where's he off? Somewhere. He's got places to be, I guess. Um, I better chase after him, because I don't know where the fuck he's going. Wait, how did he get up there? That's a lot of money. Oh. Staircase is right here. I'm blind. Right, he is actually running away from us. No. Stay right there. What? You just... Oh, fuck you. <laughs> fuck. Oh, I should have expected that. I really should have expected that. I knew it'd play some kind of cheap trick on me like that. Like fucking hell. Ugh, we'll take a time with this. We won't chase him so fast, you know. I hear a lot of enemies, actually. Like a fair amount of them. Might want to take my time with this. I bet you those explosives downstairs are going to come in use. I bet there's an enemy around the corner. No, there isn't. Okay, never mind. So, kind of... Keep it wide, you know, as we run around. I might want to heal. Yeah, I think I'm going to not be stingy, use this green herb right here. Uh... What? Mm -mm -mm. No. Sorry, I just took- I just took my hands off my keyboard and my mouse in complete disbelief there at what the fuck is going on. There is a machine gun in the middle of this room. I mean, why not, I guess, but... I thought for a moment there might be other enemies. Where, where the fuck is he shooting from? Can't tell. From the left? I think so. Right, fuck it. Jump, run, jump through there quickly. Oh, shit, that's bad. That's really bad. Fuck. I didn't think he was right there. Um, what to do? Uh, back through the... Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, that's really bad. Fuck it. Get through there quick. Come on. How do I deal with him? Guys, do you want to drop some hints? You're more than welcome to now. I guess I'm just going to have to pick him off. Like, um, you know, try and get him in between reloading. But you know what? He really, really doesn't spend much time reloading. That's for sure. Oh, fuck. Like, now, maybe? Nope, that shot him directly in the head, which he has covered. I need cover. That pillar, that pillar might work, yeah. Okay, go, 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 go. Right, stay there. You know what, I really don't feel comfortable behind this pillar. It doesn't really provide a lot of cover, does it? Um... Oh, God, what? How do I, um... How do I deal with that? Grenade, grenade. I can throw a grenade down on him. I just need to get to the other side, and then I can throw a grenade on him quite easily. Yeah. But... I'm gonna have to move fast. Um, stay, 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 stay. What a shame he can't duck in this game. That would be really fucking useful. <sighs> Fuck. Right, okay, I need to heal myself again. Like, this is not going so well. Right, um... 
Run, run, run. Get down here. Just, yeah. Not actually high enough to hit me, is he? I don't think. I hope he isn't, anyway. No, I don't look like it. Right, that's good. Um, because now we're close enough to actually throw a grenade at him. Right. That did something. Unfortunately, he didn't kill him, did he? Uh, shotgun. Nope. Fuck. Fuck it, I'm gonna toss another grenade at him. Um, also, like... You know, I earlier I said about the, um... You don't reckon we can actually shoot this down? No, I don't get a target on it, do I? Ugh, God. Where can I hit him from? I can maybe get him, like, here, because at the moment he's kind of a little bit exposed, isn't he? Only slightly, though. No, that's just at an angle. Shit. I need to move over a little bit. Just hope he doesn't hit me. This really isn't good enough. No, it isn't, Saul. Nope. <sighs> Fuck. What do I do? What do I do? Um, I'm just gonna have to continue grenading him as I was before. Just casually walk towards him. Right. Still going. There must be another way of doing this because... No, that completely missed. Fuck. I think I've got to, like, rotate him fast enough or something like that to actually hit him. I don't know. I actually don't have a clue what I'm doing with this. Uh, right, let's let's try running and see how fast he can actually, you know, if he can keep up with us. Right. No, he has trouble. He has trouble keeping up with us. That's what you gotta do. Fuck, but I'm gonna get hit now. Ah, shit. Well, what I need to do is get behind him. And then magnum him, I think. I mean, that's probably the best option. Like, if I do that quickly. Yeah, there we go. Got him. Fucking hell. That was not nice. Wow, that key looks kind of similar to the ones in Resident Evil 2. And I just used all of my fucking... Gallery key, lovely. I just used all of my, um... <laughs> all of my grenades on him, and pretty much all my bullets as well. Like, uh, sorry, I mean, my health supplies, not my bullets. Didn't really fire at him that much at all. That was quite an easy solution as well. Uh, damn it. Well, this is what happens when you haven't played a game before, I suppose. Um, now how do I get up to, uh, where he was again? Oh, of course, gotta go the long way round. He didn't actually open any shortcuts or anything like that, did he? Can't believe he spawned one bloody guy just to, you know, whack me when I ran around that corner there. I probably could have got him before he even started doing any of this shit. But, you know, whatever. If I would have actually knocked him down or something. Maybe this is preventable. Maybe it's completely preventable. I don't know. Right, so, um, yeah, we're moving on to the next area. What's this then? It's locked. Yeah, we can use the key. There we go. Right, and head on through, please. Okay, this is actually, um... What? Oh. Oh, this is a puzzle? And there's actually, um... I see a gem up there. In that DSi. Cool. It's a blue velvet again. Or velvet blue, should I say. And um, what's on the other side? We have two vases. Cool. Give me that. Thank you. Alright. Okay. So now, um, wow, these are a bit morbid, aren't they? We've got two women hanging. Twice. We've got, um, Christ cru uh, the Christ crucifixion, and then we've got a guy ready to be beheaded by a guillotine, I guess. So these are forms of, um, capital punishment? Uh, I don't get it. What? 
That's kind of what they all have in common, isn't it? You know, public execution, maybe. The sacrifice of six lives shall make way f the true path. Six lives. Six lives. So we just need six... Right, I see. Okay, so we just need one, two, and three. I'm assuming. No, that's not quite right. Okay, so... I get it. We need... Sorry, I thought what we needed to do was select six people on the on the pictures, but what it is is we need to keep on rotating this until we have six lives on display, I suppose. So one turns one and two. Two turns three of them. Three turns these three on this side, and then four turns... Right, I get it. Okay. So, um, I think maybe turning this again would be a good idea. I think I've just... Fucking hell. That was quick. <laughs> no effort. No effort. Right. Let's move through, shall we? Oh, what's this? That... Okay, it's just cells all again. Surprise. But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you I'm don't scared of his gods. Me, get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise, but I'm only 20 years old. What? So you're 20? just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. <laughs> oh, right. Whole bunch of enemies. Holy shit. That is a lot. That is a, um, a lot of enemies. 